Srimi Prabhupada's disciples came down uh, to Bhuvaneswar, but there wasn't much to see. You know, it's just Prabhupada had laid the cornerstone for the future temple. And uh, they had gone to Puri, and Srila Prabhupada had, um, had been negotiating with the pandas of Jagannath Puri temple that uh, I want to meet with you, let's meet, let's talk, and uh, I want all of my disciples and international disciples from all over the world to be able to take darshan of Lord Jagannath. He's not uh, the Lord of Puri, he's the Lord of the universe. So he wanted to do that. So the, the appointment was made, the site was chosen, it was a slight promontory with one tree for shade just right on the beach, right off the beach, very near Puri. And there were probably 20 uh, devotees, men and women, mixed in audience, in entourage. And Srila Prabhupada was sitting, being fanned and chamara, and he would, you know, chant in japa for a little while, then maybe he'll speak a few words, and then we'd chant japa again. And this went on and on for about an hour and a half, and we were sitting there. It was n noticeable. We were watching him visibly get angry, very angry. So the pandas from Puri Temple had stood up Srila Prabhupada. They had stood him up. They had no show. They did not show up. And Srila Prabhupada was quite angry. He, okay, he was furious. He went nuclear. Um, and that is when he made the famous statement that if the pandas do not change this, this Maya attitude, um, then Lord Jagannath himself will get up and walk to and stay at our ISKCON temple. So some devotees assumed that meant the temple in Bhuvaneshwar. And now, then later, later years, ISKCON actually bought land uh, near Puri and they plan to build a temple. So we don't know which temple uh, Lord Jagannath w w will walk to when it, when it happens, if it happens. But I'm told repeatedly that the Pandas of Puri are very much afraid of this, pr this prediction by a pure devotee of Lord Krishna. Very much afraid to this day.